In this video, I'll show you how to strip silence in Studio One. Well, Studio One has no end of great features for editing and mixing audio, and stripping out all the quiet bits is another thing it can do really well. Here you will see I've got silence around here and around here in my audio, also here and here. And this is really simple to use. You can use it by simply collecting this strip silence icon in the top of your Studio One program. When I click that, it's gonna give me options. Now, this is only a short piece of audio of five seconds in duration, but if it was like five hours, I might wanna do this on a smaller part by using my cut tool here, and then I can go ahead and make a cut here and here and use strip silence only on this particular part of audio. But as it's so short, I will undo the cut and I'll just work on the whole audio. So it's asking me here, well, what do you want to do? Get rid of little silence, the noise floor only, lots of silence. What do you want to do? Let's stick with the suggestion here of little silence and see what happens. We can change all of these parameters if we want to make nice, easy pre-rolls and post-rolls, fade-ins and fade-outs. But let's just try everything on default and see how it works by applying. Boom. Wow, that's removed quite a lot of silence. Let's listen to how it sounds. This is me speaking. Now, as you can hear, it's clipping my audio. It's way too harsh. I need to go back and readjust this so I can get something a little bit better. So instead of lots of silence or little silence, let's go to noise floor only. And hopefully this is going to be a bit better. Apply. Boom. It is a bit better, but it's still stripping out bits in between my words, which is not ideal. So this is where we really need to fine tune it. And we can say, OK, minimum length. Let's increase that minimum length of silence so as not to get the gaps between my words. Apply. Now we're getting closer. Now we're getting just the audio we want to keep, but not all of the silence around. And now we can undo again, and maybe we can make that stronger with little silence and apply again. Boom. That's looking very good, very healthy. Undo again with Command or Control Z, and we can increase the pre-roll and the post-roll and we can even make a, a pre-roll and post-roll uh, fade in and fade out all linked together here apply and boom look at that we get fade ins and fade outs and you can really isolate audio using this wonderful silence detection and strip feature this is great for podcasters if you're stripping out the silence from a podcast particularly if you're working with multiple tracks and you need to get rid of the silence in between the speech so your track goes silent when your guest is speaking and your guest track goes silence when you're speaking you can also do it on voiceover sessions when you get those 30 minute voiceover sessions and you just want to strip out the bits of speaking. This feature in PreSono Studio One is absolutely fantastic. If you've enjoyed watching this video, you clearly like Studio One and you'd like to learn more. I did a video on DSs in Studio One. You should definitely watch it. It's on your screen somewhere right now. And keep watching for more Studio One tips and tricks.